what is going on guys and welcome to css tutorial in this video we're going to look at something really cool and that is how to make a drop down uh, image right so we are going to create an image and there's going to be a drop down from that so first again we would have to create a div over here and i'm just going to give it a class again a container like this container yeah right and then within that div the first thing we're all going to do is we're just going to place an image and I was debating between a Kevin Hart and a Walmart lady and eventually obviously I settled for the Walmart lady because over here I'm just going to pick Walmart and I'm going to say the width of that picture should be like 50 pixels so I'm going to close it here and now I can see our picture and within that div obviously we would have to create a class a div with a class of content that's going to be the actual uh stuff that's going to be showing and over here within that content we're going to place two things and the first thing and what i'm going to place over here is going to be another image that's going to be the larger image so i'm going to say source and again i'm just going to say a, a images and over here is going to be a walmart but this time the width i'm going to make it like 300 right and over here underneath the picture I'm also going to make another div and I'm just going to say that the class is going to be a text over here like this and within that text I'm going to say nice pants something like this so now we're done pretty much with HTML now we just need to make sure that as we're hovering only then it's showing right so again the first thing we would need to do is we're going to go to quick edit and the most basic thing is we say that we want it to be display and display should be inline block over here and the next thing what we're going to do is uh, we're actually going to say a position and the position is going to be relative over here. Those are the two things that we keep doing with the drop down menus. So you should be already familiar with them. And the next thing we're going, we're actually going to the content and we're styling the content. And with the content, again, we're going to say that the position is going to be a absolute over here. And I'm going to say that the Z index is going to be one. And the next thing that I would want to say is obviously display is actually going to be none for now, right? We're going to only display it as we're hovering. And that's going to be pretty much uh, it for the content. So we're going to save it over here. And let's just jump to main CSS. And let's say that as we are hovering over container, over here, we'll say hover, uh, the content class, right? We would want it to be display. Uh, display block right so we go over here and we say display block and now we go back and now I can see what happens right only when we're hovering it's pretty much showing this picture and if we wanted to we can go to the uh, class text over here and maybe do some styling over here so I'm going to do a quick edit and I can just say text align center I don't know background color uh, background color something I don't know like uh, red again as always typical typical for me so let's just save it and you can see the nice pants and, and and all that stuff right so now you can see how you can make some cool drop down images if you want to add to your web page just by doing like a simple drop down image uh, this is going to be it for this video guys thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next I'm going to go to the hospital.